There are lots of videos out there on how to upgrade your old thermostat to a smart thermostat. But my house has two zones with a separate thermostat upstairs and downstairs. I recently upgraded them both to Ecobee smart thermostats with voice control. In this video, I'm going to explain why I couldn't follow the standard installation instructions, and I'll also share what I learned so you can do this yourself. This video is sponsored by Ecobee. The ideal way to heat or cool a house would be for each room to have its own HVAC system and thermostat, just like hotel rooms. Then each room could maintain the perfect temperature for the space. But that's not always practical, so most homes have one single HVAC system, usually forced air. And undoubtedly there will be warm areas and cold areas of the house, depending upon things like the number of windows, sun exposure, and distance from the furnace. A good compromise is to create a climate control system with multiple zones, usually one per floor, to help maintain comfort throughout the house. Large homes can have multiple systems, with a thermostat controlling each. But my house is different. It has two zones, with only one HVAC unit. This is accomplished using dampers in the ducts and a zone board attached to the furnace. When a thermostat calls for heat, the zone board opens up the appropriate dampers and turns on the furnace. If both zones are calling for heat, it opens all the dampers. One of the potential issues with multiple zones is when downstairs calls for heat, but upstairs gets too hot and it wants air conditioning. You can easily waste energy by having the two zones work against each other. Ecobee smart thermostats not only work with my zone board, but they can also be grouped together so they work as one system. We'll talk more about that later. One of my favorite features of the Ecobee is occupancy detection. Not only does the thermostat have a built-in occupancy sensor, the kit also comes with one remote smart sensor that can be placed in another room. With smart sensors, Ecobee will make sure you're comfortable in whatever room you're in. I also like that Ecobee comes with the power extender kit that let me install it even though my home didn't have a C-wire. If you've never heard of a C-wire, be sure to pause this and go watch my video called Thermostat Wiring Explained using the link in the top corner or the video description. Ecobee makes DIY installation really easy because the app guides you through the whole process in five easy steps. Remove your old thermostat. Label the thermostat wires. Install the power extender kit if needed. Install the Ecobee mounting plate and then set up the Ecobee. If you've got multiple zones with separate systems, you can follow the app instructions exactly to replace each one of your thermostats. But because I have two thermostats with just one furnace, I couldn't follow the app guide exactly. And here's why. My system has a zone board attached to the furnace. It has a bunch of wires connected to it, and they all look the same, so it can be confusing. After removing the cover, I determined where the two thermostats were connected on the left, and the furnace was connected on the right. I could tell this zone board supports three zones, but my house only has two. I could also tell that the zone board has a connection for the C-wire, but my builder didn't use it, probably because it saved a little money by running five wires instead of six. So for my Ecobee thermostats to work, I needed to install two power extender kits on the zone board, not the furnace. I didn't need to open the furnace at all, like the app instructed. I removed the green, yellow, and red wires from the zone board and connected them to the power extender kit. Then I connected the five wires coming out of the power extender kit into the zone board, including the C-wire. Now in case you're wondering, that fifth blue wire that I didn't connect to the power extender kit, it's for second stage heat. Not all furnaces are gonna have that. It may not be the prettiest installation, but it works great. It's possible the furnace transformer may need to be upgraded if it's not strong enough to power a zone board plus two smart thermostats. Mine seems to be handling it fine, but you should just be aware of this potential issue. I must say, one of my favorite features of the Ecobee 
is the smart sensor which measures temperature and occupancy in different rooms. They can virtually follow you around the house and keep you comfortable wherever you are. But I put them in bedrooms and I configured my thermostats to use those sensors to keep the bedrooms comfortable at night while we're sleeping behind closed doors. And they work great. Initially, when I set up my two thermostats, they were both visible in the Ecobee app, but they were completely independent. I needed to set up everything twice because each one had its own settings and schedules. One of the issues with having two independent thermostats is that they could work against each other. Downstairs could be set for heat, but the upstairs could be set for air conditioning. But then I discovered the capabilities of Ecobee.com. I logged in with the same credentials as I use in the app, and I could see all the details of my thermostats, and I could control them just like with the app. But then I literally stumbled upon the ability to create a thermostat group with my two thermostats. And you could only do this on the website. This is not available in the app. This let me choose the exact settings that should be shared between the two thermostats. Now I chose to keep separate comfort settings and schedules, but they both share the same address, vacation setting, and most importantly, the same system mode. Now, if I change one thermostat to heat or cool, the other will automatically switch to the same mode, so they'll never be working against each other. If you've got multiple thermostats in your home, the Ecobee Smart Thermostat with Voice Control is a great option, whether you have a zone board or multiple systems. So leave a comment if you have any questions about my installation. And in my next video, link in the description, I'll show you how to leverage the Ecobee Smart Thermostat to not only monitor the comfort of your home, but also the security of your home with the Ecobee Haven service. So be sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Welcome home. Be sure to subscribe and watch our new series, The Living Flip. Ooh. Look. That has inch and a quarter. It's a little one. That's all I know.